go. I am not doing my pointless and useless math work. Yes you are, Loris. Get it done or I will give you an automatic X minus and a big fat giant zero on that worksheet. No. I am not doing it. Loris, if you don't do your algebra work, I will give you an automatic F and a zero on your report, and we won't have school on Friday, because July 14th is the last day of math. And that day, we will have a final exam on all the knowledge you learned about algebra, calculus, trigonometry, linear equations, polynomials, quadratic formula, and linear algebra. No. I am shredding my algebra worksheet into trillions and quintillions of pieces. It's so hard, annoying. Difficult and complicated. Can't I just go home and play games all day? Oh really? I like your story anyways. How about a quick trick to the principal's office? Let's see how Dr. Harris would feel once you tell him about what you did. Oh no, not Laris. What did you do this time? I refused to do the algebra homework and I shredded it. Go on. Give me consequences. Okay, you are suspended for two days. Also, you will be receiving an early start after school detention with Terrace and Fate Doris. Go there right now. Welcome to detention. There will be no talking, no sleeping, no daydreaming, no humming, no electronics, no giant balloons, no YouTube, no laptop, no food, no drinks, no music, no toys, no crying, and most importantly, no escaping this room under any circumstances. You are here until your parents pick you guys up at 5 p.m. Use the next few hours to study for your math exam. I will be calling all of your parents. You three stay here and don't even think about escaping this room until your parents pick you guys up. This is just great. We all have to stay here until 5 to wait for our parents to pick us up at 5 p.m. This is the worst day ever. I understand on how you feel, Loris. But Mr. Dallas said that we are not allowed to talk in detention, so we better be quiet before Mr. Strike Back comes. Let's go home right now, you all are in so much trouble.